What's going on everybody man? Welcome to this video. Typically I will start a video with what's going on trading world, but guess what? This is not a regular video. This video, if you're my subscriber or if you're my hater or if you're somebody who's looking for forex motivation, proof, um, a little bit of entertainment, just I'm asking you and I'm requesting you to please watch this video till the end. All right, watch this video till the end. Typically, I do, you know, Forex mot uh, forex motivation by showing po uh, payouts, things like that. But this video, um, we're going to go into a little bit of a crazy stuff. It's going to be a little bit of entertainment. It's going to start off with a little bit of um, aggressiveness, right? But then I'm slowly going to move into my story and why I am where I am and some other people are not where they are. And I'm going to... All right, we need the camera in. We need the camera to work before this video. All right, let's go. All right, let's go. Listen, I want you to watch this video throughout, okay? It's going to be funny. It's going to be entertaining. It's going to be motivational. I got a little bit of something for the haters as well. I got the lighting right there. Shit, you can see my face. Um, this is going to be an interesting video, let me tell you that. So before we start the video, let me tell you what we're going to cover in this video. If you want to watch it, if you're my old subscriber, if you're in my community, it's going to be a fun video, man. It's going to be a fun little 10 minutes uh, to kill. So what we're going to do is this. All right. Last week, I posted a video where I posted truthfully and honestly, honestly about my losses. OK, and I got the most backlash I've ever gotten on a video. Strange that when I tell people that I lost money, it's like people hate me, like, wow, like you're lying. They wanna see my losses. Apparently I'm lying about the losses, I don't know. So we're gonna address that right in the start, okay? Then we're gonna move into the chart work. We're gonna, I'm gonna tell you how my psychology failed and which trade failed me, how I could have improved it, the mistake that I made, how you can never make that mistake again, okay? I wasn't following risk management, we'll go into that. Uh, then I'm going to go into how I made all of that money back in a day and a half. Monday, today's Tuesday, 1.50 p.m. We've already made that money back plus, 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 plus through Discord because we're killing it. Um, I'm going to give you a little bit of inside story about how I got to this point of mental toughness and why I can continue to trade while people are telling me to write off my career um, just because I took one loss. I already made it back, bro plus plus some gonna throw in a little bit of a Andrew Tate viz wisdom Andrew Tate wisdom and I'm gonna give you a little bit of my story of how I got to where I got to before I release the real video which I'm shooting in a couple of days I'm gonna go back to my old workplace and you know show you where I used to wash cars or whatever whatever all right let's just get this goddamn video started and in the end I'm gonna tell you how we are leveling up how we are leveling up and how you can join and be part of the community, man, or any community. I'm going to give you guys a list of people that I know that are good traders that you can go follow um, and learn from them. So let's just get this video popping, man. Let's go. Okay, so first thing first, I post a video about my lost $18,000 I lost, right? Video's right here. Uh, let's go to the video right now. And there, there's fucking idiots. There's people, trolls. I don't know where they come from. This is I wrote how I lost $18,000 in U.S you know whatever this is after me murdering the prop firm game and the forex game getting interviewed by ftmo giving away a free strategy eleven thousand dollar withdrawal fucking seven thousand dollars eight thousand dollars twenty five thousand dollars that forty five thousand dollar video i got coming up just challenges being smashed left right center seventy nine hundred dollar withdrawal like come on man i post one video about a loss and people say you know what people said they said, oh, this guy's lying. Uh, why don't you show us uh, where you lost the money? Like, it's like I'm lying, bro. So, okay, fine. R really? So, this, so I'll, put, I'll put the screenshot up on the video. Um, you know, it's the, it's the same screenshot that's posted on my Instagram. $16,499.56. Okay, buddy. Let's go. Let's go do this. Come on. Here is my broker statement from 8cap limited for July 7th, 2022, $16,499.56. So for you fucking trolls that wanted to see proof of how I lost the money, I even got a DM like one hour ago. I can't believe you lost that money. I don't believe it. Bro, what? Like, have you, have you people been 
uh, scammed so much that you just like cannot accept reality anymore. You know, you just want to be lied to. So it just makes you feel better or something. I don't know. People, people have gone delusional. Anyways, this is the last time I'm making an arrogant video. I'm, I'm usually a very nice guy. But anyways, there's going to be some motivation in this. Keep watching. Keep watching the video, bro. I'm about to go into some deep, deep, deep motivation. All right. Just give me a second. Give me a second. All right. So we got this fucking thing out the way. Excuse my language. I'm going to be swearing in this one. It is what it is. Whew. Um, all right. All right. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go into the next thing. Let's go into the next thing. The next thing was, uh, oh, beautiful trade falling right now. Killed it this week with this AUD CHF. All right. Last week, it was a Wednesday. I believe it was a Wednesday last week, Wednesday hourly chart right here. I believe this was the area right here. I had a supply drawn right here. Liquidity sitting below. Um, a trade I shared in Discord. Now, I just happen to have, have one small personal account. I have a larger personal account. And this is another fucking thing. People started saying, oh, this guy's a, he's, he's a write-off. He, he shouldn't be teaching people how to trade because he's over-leveraging. Listen, I have one account. I put a bunch of my withdrawal, two withdrawals actually from my Forex ones in. And I tried to flip the account and I failed. That No big deal, okay? Um, I have a larger account, which I did not do this on, which is a personal account. And I'm not showing my personal accounts ever, ever again because people call them fake. And I'm not even showing my larger one for personal reasons. I told that in my last payout video that I'm going to stop doing so many payout videos. I just don't want people seeing them anymore, man. I've, sh I've been doing it for a year. Name me one other YouTuber who's shown this many fucking payouts on YouTube. I'll wait. Exactly. All right. So anyways, this was the trade. I loaded it up. 32 lots here. Boom. Overnight. Took me out. Um, and my psychology just kind of collapsed. I don't know why. It was my ego. Um, and I and I tried to enter again. Boom. Out again. $16,900. Flat. Gone. On the Wednesday. Uh, Wednesday. Yeah. Wednesday. Thursday. I, did, I didn't trade. Friday. I told everybody I'm taking a break. Went out. Had an amazing weekend. Went downtown Toronto. Had a great time. We chilled. Partied. Whatever. All right, spent, spent like a bunch of money. Um, excuse my arrogance in this video. So anyways, that was that done. Okay, now now Monday I show up to the markets. All right, at this point, my psychology is a little gone. My psychology is a little gone because I'm getting all these hateful messages from retards telling me to quit trading, why I have a course, uh, I shouldn't trade, like my career is a write-off. I don't know what the fuck's wrong with people. Anyways, we come back on Monday, right? We come back Monday morning. Bam. AUD. Uh, and this was called by one of my members in Discord, man. Shout out to Jay. Jay Edwards, bro. This dude is murking the game in Discord. I'm going to tell you guys how we're about to murder everything. Any trading community cannot stand against us anymore. It's over for everybody. Uh, so right back into the game on Monday on my funded account, which I'm going to show you and my personals. Boom, boom. Um, on this trade alone... Alone on this trade, I closed ten thousand dollars, ten percent. Scale in after scale in after scale in after scale in. And if you want some real proof, go look at my Telegram. I was sending this shit live for free, which I'm not doing anymore. We were sending this in Discord free, live, not doing it anymore. Um, there was USD CHF, boom, murdered this trade. Sent this. No, I didn't. I sent this in Discord, not in Telegram. Murdered this trade. What else did we have? We had AJ this morning, still running. I closed it out for full. I, I'm done for the week. I've made too much damn money. I made all the money that I lost $18,000 plus, 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 plus. $14,000 on one funded account, $4,000 on another funded account. And I'm not telling you how much I made on my bigger personal account. No need to, but I will show you the funded accounts though. I will show you the funded accounts. Now, that's done. I showed you how I lost the money. I showed you how I made it back in one and a half day. Listen, it's all about skill set. Okay, let me go into the motivational part of the video, which I said I would do. If you're with me, man, just stick stick with me till here. I'm about to drop some game on you right now, okay? Listen, something, there's something called skill set. 
you can have it as a musician you can have it as if you're an e-commerce like person you can have it as a sales person there's some serious sales people in the world who have a serious game you know my brother's being one of them uh you know big time car salesman opened up his own dealership big big boss things uh, real real estate agents you know the top 1% forex traders there's top 1% only 1 to 2% of forex traders are making good money everybody else sucks okay This is what it is, man. I'm not editing this video. Um, so uh, when when it comes to skill set, right? For me to build this skill set, it took me three years. So when somebody comes to me and tells me your career is over, you suck at trading, you can't trade anymore, bro. What the fuck are you talking about? Do you know what I went through to build this skill set? Do you know that once you spend three, four years building a skill set, nobody can take it away from you? Your fucking wife can leave you. the world can humiliate you people can bring up your past things you've done wrong in the past you know the, the the bank can come after you you know you could end up going to jail for a couple of years some shit could happen but nobody can take your skill set from you man you could put some of these top big traders i'm not even going to say their names put them away for 2 3 4 years they'll come out in a week and be smacking once you build your skill set which is the hardest thing to do Okay, and I can't tell you exactly how to do it. All I know is for the 3 years in a row, I couldn't sleep. I couldn't eat. I couldn't do anything without thinking about how I'm going to become one day for profitable in forex. It's all I thought about, it's all I dreamt about. I used to wake up middle of the night 3 a.m. like, "Whoa." Looking at my phone like a crazy person. Like my parents would be like they were telling me I needed a psychiatrist. Family was telling me, "You're crazy. You're gambling. You're going to lose all your money." focus on your job i got two promotions i turned them down i got like you know everybody was yelling at me calling me crazy but i i wanted that skill set so now i know even if i knew on thursday i lost $18,000 i was upset it hurt a little bit went out had a good time came back monday tuesday 150 i'm already done trading for the week baby it's over all right here we are in my my forex funds dashboard Um all right let me let me open up my MT4 on my phone so I can look at it live with everybody okay so when I I said something in that video where I said something in around that you know what uh I'm going to make this money back I'm going to make it back 2 3 to x whatever I said something and I also said in the end on my larger account for some reason these people don't hear what is being said they thought I was going to flip another account whatever whatever said done whatever happened all right this is my my one my forex funds accounts one of them let's go to daily let's go let's just go to weekly man weekly okay weekly we're sitting at around i've made so far for the week let me just get this open $14,000 that's done for the week equity sitting at 114 i get payouts every 2 weeks every 2 weeks i get at least 8 Seven, eight, nine thousand. This week, this was from Monday, and now it's Tuesday at like it's whatever. It's two p.m. now while I'm trying to record this video. This is one funded account. All right, one funded account with True Forex Funds. Another one. I have four thousand there, and on my personal larger account, the one that I was actually talking about in that video. I'm not going to show that, but trust me, I made back two, three x of what I lost. Now, with that being said. Let's go back to the little bit of motivational thing. Let me let me I'm going to put this little Andrew Tate clip in here. All right. You need to give this a listen for a second. If you identify and accept that you are broke because you're not on my level, then we must work out why. And there's only one of three reasons that anyone on this planet would ever be poor. You're either lazy, you're arrogant, or you're stupid. Now, we'll start with lazy. Most So that's it, man. Like I uh But I didn't need to hear this. But it's either you're arrogant, stupid, or lazy. Okay, a lot of these people that leave dumbass comments, arrogant. Okay, some of these people are stupid. Some people are just stupid. But I, don't, I really don't think a lot of people are stupid. If you are, God help you. Arrogance. Nobody can help you, man. Nobody can help you. I never once in four to five years, when I was learning, went to somebody's video and I'm like, "Yo, why is this guy making so much money, man? He's a scam." What? I'd be like, "Hey, hey, listen. Uh, can you help me? How do I buy your course?" Like I was literally that person. 
So I, and then it came down to laziness, right? And I think majority of Forex traders are straight up fucking lazy. I have 400, like 300 people in my, in my Discord group. There's 40 people that are active, 20 that are super active every day, sharing trades, um, sharing new ideas, talking to me, DMing me, asking me for help. And these are the ones that are killing it. These are the students that are making 20, 30, 40,000 profit splits. 7,000, 6,000, someone just sent me a 13,000 split the other day. Every week they're passing challenges. Where's everybody else? Same thing with the rest of the trading community, any trading community, everybody's just fucking lazy. Are you putting in, okay, if you work a nine to five, right? I worked a nine to five for the two years that I was learning. I woke up every day at 4 a.m. From 4 a.m. to 8.30, I would do chart work and trade. After I got off at five, I would do, take maybe about 15, 20 minute break, go lay down in bed, wake back up, get back on the computer, and trade and learn and do courses till like 11, 12, sleep four or five hours. In middle of those four or five hours, I would wake up in the middle of the night to check my phone two, three times. I was being called crazy. But that was called dead fucking cation to my skill set. Once you have a skill set, this, this, sh this shit is no problem. I could lose this tomorrow and build it right back. So for the motivation, for the people that stuck around to this part of the video to hear the motivation is just you lazy all right there's no other excuse to it i like the way he says it there's no other there's pick one what are you arrogant stupid or lazy just pick it i knew what i was i figured that out a long time ago i was just lazy i was washing cars wasn't thinking about doing anything i got my ass out of washing cars by studying digital marketing google certificates all night all day 18 hours a day in the heat in Pakistan somewhere I was gone away went away from Canada just went fucking into a village turned on a computer and sat there and just studied for fucking four weeks same thing with trading it's literally what it is you literally join a community and you just work that's it you join a community you can join any community man there are so many good traders that you can learn from I can just name some on top of my head man Matt to millions Steve Luke the Viper group Otis Hill um, excuse me if I'm missing anybody else. Train and trade, man. Train and tra trade. Omar. All of these traders. It, go learn from anybody. It doesn't have to be us. It does not have to be us. It doesn't have to be us, bro. But um, the trading LP community is about to blow up because we have now come together as, a, as the best traders that are in my community. We're starting a channel where we're just going to post our A-plus grade setups. We're going to come up with a list of the, what A-plus setups looks like. We're all going to be looking for them during our sessions. And when we find one, we're going to share it and we're all going to make bank. Okay. This is what I wanted to cover in this video. That's it. I just wanted to show proof to these haters that, that I wanted to see my losses. Showed it. Um, people wanted to see how I was going to make the money back. I made it. I showed it. Um, people wanted to talk. Oh, yeah. There's one thing I didn't show yet, actually. I would love to, to, to go into that. Let's do that, actually. Um, you know... Um, showed that gave you a little bit of motivation straight up motivation uh you know there was a video i made a video i made look at it seven months ago seven months ago i made this video i don't know if the volume if the audio is going to play or not i don't think it does um but if you do go back i'll put it up in the cards you know go back and listen to this part right here i said this before i even had 10 students i said we're going to build the best trading community Everybody's going to go to the top with me. I'm going to get a bunch of people funded. A bunch of people are going to be able to quit their jobs. And it's already been done. I've already done it. We've already done the webinars. We've already gotten people funded. We've gotten the profit splits. I've done everything I said in this video. I spoke it to the universe. You literally hear me saying I'm speaking this to the universe. November 20th, 2021. Done, did, finished. It's game over. Now I'm speaking something else. And I'm telling you, the people now that we have in our community... The people that are active, some of the hitters, man, some of the people who were like, we meeting up in, in, in London in August, Dubai in September. It's going to be wild, man. But but some of these people in this, and we're about to take this community shit to the next level, man. Everybody's going to be caking. So I apologize if this video was a bit long. Um, you know, you heard some arrogance from myself, but I hope something motivated you, something sparked you. You know, my, my little talk about the skill set sparked you. Wait for that video I do about, you know, how I got to where I got to. Because I'm going to show you guys some stuff that happened in my life, man. 
um, some of the things that I, had, that I had to overcome to get to this stage. So, you know, when, when I hear these comments, it, it makes no difference to me because I know personally deep down inside, I worked on the skill set. I, I got here by, by the sheer hustle, ambition, pain, tears, sweat that I put in. And if you do the same, I don't see why I don't see why you can't hit your goals, man. Anyways, peace. Have a great day, everybody.